Hello, welcome to Vitality for Daily Living. Our topic for today is, when you die, what will happen to you? The scripture for today is Luke chapter 16 verse 22 to 25. I read, So it was the beggar that died, and was carried by the angels to Abraham's bosom. The rich man also died and was buried, and being in torment and hate, he lifted up his eyes and saw Abraham afar off and Lazarus in his bosom. And he cried and said, Father Abraham, have mercy on me and send Lazarus that he may dip the tip of his finger in water and cool my tongue. For I am tormented in this flame. But Abraham said, Son, remember that in your lifetime you received your good things and likewise Lazarus' evil things. But now he is comforted and you are tormented. Many people keep wondering what will happen to them when they die. Our scripture reading for today answers this question. When we die, we will see that all those who were receiving good things on earth and enjoying life here will receive all the evil things in hell. And those who are living a sad life and suffering here on earth may receive all the good things in heaven. In death, there will be a reversal of rules. The first shall be the last and the last shall be the first. We, from the scripture, we see that the rich, the rich man was living in a relatively bad place compared to the poor man. The poor man was in Abraham's bosom and then the rich man was suffering in hell. The rich man was powerless and needed water, but then he couldn't get it. These were the same experiences the poor man went through down on earth. When you die, you will vividly remember everything that happened to you on earth. In other words, your senses will be fully at work. You will remember all the preachings and messages from various preachers, you remember all the altar calls which you do not respond to. You remember all the time the Holy Spirit prompted you not to sin and you still did it. When you die, you will wish you had lived your life with eternity in view in your heart daily. Do you know if you accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, all these things will not be new to you when you die. Your relationship with Jesus here on earth is the beginning of your journey to heaven. Let's pray. Lord Jesus, today I come to you as a sinner. Forgive me of all my sins and wash me by the blood of Jesus. I receive Jesus into my life anew. Help me stay pure and make it to heaven at the end of my life on earth. Amen.